You know, it's a matchup as, as old as time, man. It's the uh, prospect versus the veteran. We're both bangers. We both want the same thing. We both want to make it to the top. It comes down to who's hungrier. Is it the one that has never been there and never tasted it? Or is it the one that's tasted it and had it taken away from him? He's seen me fight, I've seen him fight. So we both know our flaws. We both know everything about each other. And this is the fight business. I got mouths to feed and bills to pay. And they don't care if you're fighting your friend or not. It just needs to be handled, you know what I'm saying? So we can be friends afterwards. I got coaches that are phenomenal. That's the difference between me and these other fighters out here. I always try to get with the person who's better than me in every aspect of the fight game. And my gym is full of everything from everybody in height and size to strength. My Orlando version of Chase, right here. What's up, baby? It's all making sense to me now. So many people come into it and you think that it's black and white and you have to follow a certain structure, you know, certain fundamentals. I'm coming in to rewrite my own style as a heavyweight. I know with this fight, this will be the, the big test to see if I'm there. We're both on a crash course for the same path. We're gonna have to meet up, you know? It's just coming to that pivoting point. And one of us is gonna stay behind and one of us is gonna move forward. I'm literally expecting both of us to go to war for three rounds and uh, just give the crowd what they want. Well, my goal is to get to the top and whoever else wants to challenge me when I get there can get it. I got an unfinished business. I got a score to settle, you know? I I'm not the type of person to go leave any stones unturned. The road back there leads through Rashawn, and uh, I'm going to take what's mine.